my friends, this is Karen Bruno. Hey, Karen. Hey, Emmy. Thanks for having me on. Thank you for agreeing to be on. It's nice to see you on this Wednesday morning. It's gray here. What's the weather like there? It's actually pretty here, but it's getting colder again. It, it, I think it froze last night. So froze. I almost yeah. died on a run yesterday because it was 94 degrees. Oh my gosh. Yes. It's summer That's here. I don't know when we'll see 94 degrees. Maybe never. <laughs> okay, we'll come visit. I have a guest room. You're always invited. Next episode, we'll do live. <laughs> okay, so for people who don't know, Karen, would you give us your elevator pitch? Who are you? What do you do? Sure. So um, I am the artistic director of the Lawrence Academy Girl Choir Program in Appleton, Wisconsin. We are not in Kansas. Lawrence is the, <laughs> the name of our university that we are affiliated with, um, and we're actually a part of a community music school, but we have um, seven choirs of uh, singers who identify as female in grades three through 12, um, and we draw from um, kind of a wide range. We've got girls who drive in, and their families who drive in, you know, up to 90 minutes to two hours in wow. some cases. So we serve a pretty wide range, um, including some rural areas. Um, of Wisconsin as well. We're about two hours north of Milwaukee, so it's a, it's a pretty wide range that we cut seven choirs. Wow. Seven choirs of all different. Audition, non-audition, age, bridge. that's such a great place. And to bring in singers from such a vast span of the area. It's really cool. And I, th one of my favorite things now, having been with the program for all of these years, is to see our alums come back or to see on social media, like they're in each other's weddings and holding each other. These are like, you know, girls who would never have met one another if they would just stayed in their school programs because they're from all over, you know, private, parochial, home schools, rural schools, suburban schools. It's just, it's a beautiful community. God, it's like soon, but before we wrap up for today, is there any little nugget or tidbit that you want to share with those listening? Mm, gosh, I guess when, when it comes to thematic ideas um, and selecting repertoire, um, give yourself space and time. It's not something that can be rushed. And be relentless in, in having high expectations because those high expectations will continue to feed you and your singers. Um, you have to you have to give them the very best that you can give them, and we know that in terms of our own our own pedagogy, our own rehearsal process. But you can't you can't give your best if you're not giving them the best repertoire and and uh, curricular ideas. So investing, like you said, wow. <laughs> Thank you so much for this. I feel this was the perfect type of tip to give us a little bit of something to think on and chew on other than the, the webinar last <laughs> night. <laughs> well, thank you so much for asking. This is really fun. I am so thankful to be your friend. I hope you have a great day. Thank you, my friend. You too. Take All care. Right.